So you could just talk and it will record. Yeah. I just have to try right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can I talk now? You don't need to hold it. Okay. Just leave it like that. All right, okay. Well, dear little Lydia, well, you are not a little girl anymore. You're a young lady. I'm very pretty, I'm sure. But I remember when you were a little kid and how much fun we had in the morning because your mom liked to sleep late and you were full of laugh and we had such a good time together. It was so much fun. And you had that big, you put a big bow in your head and you look so pretty with your sparkling eyes and dark hair, and I always had a pretty dress on. We always had so much fun, and I can still hear your giggling. I wish you would come around and see us sometime soon, because I'm a hundred years old now, so you know I won't last much longer, and I would certainly love to see you at least one more time before I go, please. And Gabi will too, I'm sure. You better pretty nice right now. But soon we will have it cold and snow. I guess you're living in California, so you won't bother with that. As we will have when we have witnesses, mostly. Well, it wasn't too bad last winter, so you never know ahead of time how much it gets. But I remember all the time we had to be in the morning and we were laughing. Oh, I knew I can still hear you giggling. And you were so pretty. And we had so much fun. And I would sure love to see you again. So please come and see me before I go. I was 100 years old a few months ago. And I had a big party and it was very, very nice. A lot of my friends came and a lot of the people where I stayed made a nice party for me. So that was absolutely wonderful. Wish you had been to it. So please come and visit us. We love to have you and we have room for you. So you don't have to worry about that, okay? So, dear Lydia, please answer my wording soon. I'm 100, you know, so my day I counted. But I would love to see you at least one more time, okay? Love you. All I got from your far more. Thank <laughs> you.